Q washers, Q services, eBay and YouTube. What we're showing you here is a water tank set up. Funded tank. Baffled. Sometimes I'm baffled. Right, so this one that was used at the moment, these are available in half inch, three quarters and one inch. Stainless steel fittings. These taps, you'll see, butterfly valves. We've got three in place. So if you can imagine at this side here, you've got your water tank. This itself is a three quarter. Sometimes you want to be able to get that tank out quickly and easily. Uh, and obviously it's awkward sometimes when you've got certain fittings. So what we'll do is we'll show you how quickly it is. This is a special union and all it does is it unscrews at that point. It's a swivel fitting. So it means you can leave that in your tank, undo that part and this part can be taken off and taken out of the equation quickly and easily. No messing around. Yeah. Now what we normally do is when we're setting a tank up sometimes you've got to think about frost, you've got to think about wanting to keep the customer going while you're working and everything else and you want it to fill up with the customer's tap. Now on this side here you'll see what we're using here is a click system which is the same as a hose lock and gardini but, but a far superior quality fitting. If you were going to a customer's tap you could plug in at this point here. You can work that stage if you've got these valves open and this valve in this position you can be filling your tank up while working and supplying your pressure washer with water. Now we've set this up as a double feed. It doesn't have to be double feed, it can be just a single feed and a hose to a tail going straight into there. Sometimes then obviously you finish your job off and what you want to do is leave the water in the system itself, in the tank. So if you close that off, leave these two valves open, the water from the pump and everything else automatically run out to this side here and off it goes. You've also got that possibility sometimes you won't just fill your tank up. At that stage you turn your tap off at this point. So that's closed off. You then open this and obviously you're able to fill up. Now if you're doing it that way you'd put an overflow in the tank so as the water comes into here and goes this way into the tank it doesn't overflow as it gets fuller and fuller in the actual tank itself and spill all over your van. So you'd put a good one inch fill pipe coming out of there overflow system. But like I say, this is possible, all different ways. We can then alter it around if you wanted to, depending on your van, the way you're setting up. These fittings are where we've put them together, which I'll show you the next combination. It can be done with quickly and easily. So using the same fittings, if you can imagine having a side door, you can connect into that point from your customer's tap, straight into the tank itself, and round to your pressure washer. If you wanted to, you can spin that round, and you can have it coming this way. Just by simply using these simple fittings and everything else. Obviously PTFE tape all locked tight to lock them in place. Uh, you would be better off obviously so they don't start coming loose and everything else. But they're stainless steel, you've got your brass ends in here. And like I say, uh, this is one of the ways that we normally set our machines up and everything else to work. Like I say, the beauty about it is having this point here. This otherwise you have to take all your tank out, pull it to the edge of the van to be able to work on it. With that little flange there, it makes it so easy. Half inch, one inch, three quarters, all available. And like I say, if you wanted to, there's nothing to stop you from just having a single feed by taking this T-piece out if you wanted to and doing it that way around. And like I say, at the end of the day on this system, you don't want your machine to get frozen. So what you do is close that off, open these two valves, the water that's within the pump would automatically run out as long as you let air into the system at the pump side. Thank you much, Q Services, Q Washers, eBay and YouTube.